forum began in 1989. It was an HR conference to start with, but it evolved from just HR to HR and DNI and line management people. What if we engaged a diverse crowd, united around common actions, and shared a commitment to transformational leadership in the workplace, the marketplace, and community? It's a really large event full of really great people and you've got the breadth of diversity officers and people working in the diversity inclusion space but you've also got people from the business as well outside diversity inclusion and the interaction of those two groups is really important. The conference is one of the largest conferences in the country that brings people from all over, not only the United States but global as well. I am so gratified by the continued growth of this forum. It demonstrates a broader commitment to the issue of diversity in all of its manifestations. Diversity of thought, diversity of cultures, diversity of race, and diversity of backgrounds. There's never a time when I leave without an idea or without a new thought. And that to me is the essence of, I think, why I keep returning, not only uh, to attend sessions, but also to volunteer. So we talk about you know, diversity trends, best practices, but I really like about the, the business of diversity. Today, our company, literally across the country, has been impacted by the forum. To be able to actually see it, hear it, uh, in terms of what's going on from people, the real people, uh, and to be able to connect with them. Uh, to me, it's all about relationships. So here we are today, 25 years later. Diversity of experiences, age, race, gender, opinions, leads to diversity of thought. Our goal at the Forum has for a long time, and I think even 25 years ago, has been to look forward. So the theme for 2014 is breaking new ground. Uh, this clearly is the who's who with regards to attendees of, of all the diversity conferences that I've seen. So and I know, not only do I get to come and see all the, the, the latest thinking, but I guess see all the, the, the current thought leaders in the area of diversity and inclusion. For 2014, we have the Travelers Companies, an organization based in Hartford, Connecticut who is going to be our lead sponsor and really help us lead the way, uh, break that new ground. We're really excited about some of the new ideas, the new content, the new delivery for some of the forum workshops and content for the coming year. And it's really right on, on target with the kinds of things that we're doing um, at Travelers. We're really excited about the new direction. We want to really emphasize the forum because it's, that's the key part of what we want to create. We want to create a space where people can talk about things, argue about things, find a new way, learn about new things. So the name becomes The Forum on Workplace Inclusion. Why wouldn't you want to participate in an amazing forum? And I would say it's the best forum that I've attended in the diversity and inclusion space in the country. The networking piece is critical. We've got to stay in real conversations like the forum dictates. You got to have places where you can just go amongst other colleagues and say, well, what is that next discussion? What is that next thing we're going to do? Travelers is proud to be the lead sponsor of the 2014 Forum on Workplace Inclusion. So I hope you'll join us for the 2014 Forum on Workplace Inclusion, which will be here in Minneapolis, March 18th to the 20th, 2014. I hope we'll see you here.